I'm gonna tell people I got bit by a shark, but I'll probably be like, but the rest was great or something. A wild start to one teen summer break, the latest on his shark bite recovery straight ahead. And the desperate search for a missing boy swept away by floodwaters this morning continues with additional resources now to try to find him. Where news comes first. This is WECT's Carolina in the Morning, streaming live on WECT.com and the WECT News app. Well, good morning and thanks so much for joining us. I'm Kim Ratcliffe. And I'm Bill Murray. We've got Gannon Medrick over here today. I read your note this morning. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven days of this pattern, huh? Yeah, we've had a good pattern to, to dent up that drought. And um, this is going to be kind of like the, the, the crown jewel of the pattern today. This will be like the most widespread that we've seen. And um, it's been storming all night to our south, guys. As uh, we take a look in the forecast center, I've got the Carolina radar all called up here. Um, pick a spot that's in a severe drought. Charleston's been storming all night. as a low pressure kind of organizing along this front and it's getting ready to take a swipe at us. Um, this is a little false return here in Onslow Bay back to Long Bay, just clipping Oak Island. That's actually not any rain. I'm not even sure what that is, um, but there's actually some showers from like Surf City. You see those little guys back west toward Hallsboro, Whiteville and Cerro Gordo and then west of the state line as well. So showers are getting a chance to materialize. Temperatures are in the 60s and 70s across the viewing area this morning. A coolish 65 case in point in Elizabethtown. That's going to be part of the weather story today. Cool breezes out of the northeast under clouds, keeping our temperatures from reaching the 80s in most locations. Of course, what deserves a place in the headliner? Uh, grab the umbrella, numerous showers statement. And stay alert, a few gusty storms can try to mix in today into a portion of tonight, especially early. Rain chances back on the downswing for tomorrow as temperatures warm up. I'll have more on all of this and extend the forecast through and past Father's Day in just a few. Guys, back to you.